Top 10 Best Fantasy Anime with Super Strong Slash Overpowered Main Characters Here is my list of the top 10 strongest male anime characters and their respective anime. I didn't include any anime with more than 50 episodes or the ones that are already hugely popular like the big three, that would be One Piece, Naruto, and Bleach. These are anime with strong male characters listed in no particular order. Number 10. The Legend of the Legendary Heroes This story follows the life of Reiner Lute, a student enrolled in the Roland Empire Royal Magicians Academy. Lute's adventure begins when he is tasked by King Sile Estal to search for the relics of the legendary hero. Along his way, he discovers a deadly curse that is slowly spreading all through the continent. Reiner Lute possesses the power called the Alpha Stigma. This power manifests whenever his eyes glow red and his pupils transform into a star-shaped formation. The Alpha Stigma is said to be a curse that is laid down upon humanity by the ancient Dark Gods. The Stigma allows Lute to analyze, copy, and use any magical spells he sees. This gives him vast magical knowledge and the ability to cast a wide variety of spells. Aside from his Alpha Stigma, Lute is also the host of a Dark God. This makes him even more powerful than other Alpha Stigma bearers. However, if he is under great emotional distress, he can lose control of his sanity, which could lead him to destroy anyone and everything around him. Number 9. Chrome Shelled Regios Chrome Shelled Regios is set in a post-apocalyptic future where Earth is overrun by mutated beasts called Filth Monsters. Humanity is forced to create homes on huge mobile city called Regios. Here, the humans learn to create and use weapons called the Dite and harness them with the power of Ki to battle the beasts that threaten to wipe out mankind. Leifen is considered to be one of the strongest characters in the series. He is deemed worthy of the title Heaven's Blade at a very young age of 10. He displays skills including the ability to move at high speeds, a tremendous amount of strength, and the ability to create illusionary tricks. He also has the ability to break down key, a power source, only by observing its flow. Number 8. Ichibanushiro no Daimao The story of Ichibanushiro no Daimao primarily revolves around Akuto Sai and his enrollment in the Constant Magic Academy. He desires to be a high priest in order to help his fellow humans and to benefit society. However, his life changes forever when the school's oracular spirit, Yagaterasu, proclaims him as the future Demon King. Nearly everyone in the student body grows terrified of him, but some seek to take advantage and use his power to achieve their own goals. Okuto Sai has virtually unlimited potential, and perhaps because of this, the oracular spirit declared him the Demon King of the future. He is the only one who seems to have complete control over mana and energy projected by all living things. He's capable of creating various energy projectiles, explosions, and even absorbing mana from other beings, thus rendering them powerless. Due to his immense power potential, Akuto sometimes finds himself having great difficulty controlling his powers and can end up causing random explosions. Number 7. Kaze no Stigma the story is focused around Yagami Kazuma after he has been banished by the Kanagi family because of his lack of ability to wield the element of fire. Four years have passed and Kazuma returns to Japan as a powerful wind user. However, just as he arrives, he is blamed for a series of murders of the members of the Kanagi family. Now he finds himself in the middle of a war between the Yagami and Kanagi families. Kazuma Yagami is a wielder of the wind element also known as a Fujitsuji. He is capable of controlling the wind element to execute different kinds of techniques and attacks. Even among other Fujitsuji, Kazuma is deemed to be the strongest. He can wield other elemental powers except fire. Whenever Kazuma becomes enraged, his eyes turn bright red and he becomes able to produce pure black winds. He displays mind reading abilities while in this state. Kazuma also made a contract with the Wind Spirit Lord, or the Kaze no Seri O, thus greatly amplifying his already powerful abilities. Number 6. Campion The story of Campion revolves around Goto Kusanagi when he unknowingly killed a heretic god. 
After killing the god, Godo is declared to be a god slayer or campion. Now Godo finds himself encountering all sorts of beings like witches, gods, great knights, and other campions. Godo has displayed many abilities common to that of a campion. These abilities include, but are not limited to, magical resistance, immense magical power, and luck manipulation. Because Godo has defeated the heretic god Varith Ragna, he is also capable of using the god's 10 incarnations of power. Each power can only be used once a day, and some require a very specific condition to be used. Aside from his campion abilities, Godo is shown to be a good tactician and a deceiver. He has tricked a number of his opponents to his traps, and some ended up defeating themselves. Number 5. Hagure Yusha no Aesthetica The story is set in a world where young men and women are randomly transported to a magical world called the Eleazar. Those who survive the magical world return with supernatural abilities. An organization called Babel has been established to protect the returning heroes and give them training to help them control their power. The plot follows Akatsuki Osawa after he returned from a Lazard after he defeated a Dark Lord and whisked away his beautiful young daughter. Akatsuki Osawa is a practitioner of a martial art known as the Renkake Kiko. This martial art gives the user the ability to manipulate and control the chi of anyone and everything around him. He has been known to apply this martial art to develop different kinds of techniques. Some of his abilities include immense physical strength, nigh invulnerability, healing, and energy projection. Akatsuki's mastery of the Renkake Kiko makes him the most powerful character in the series. Akatsuki also wields a great demon sword he called the Lavatine. Number 4. Helsing Ultimate Abraham von Helsing did the impossible. He defeated a great and powerful ancient vampire and bound him to do his bidding. Hundreds of years have passed and his descendants created a secret government organization that serves as the first line of defense against the many supernatural threats that loom over the country. The plot of the anime follows the Helsing organization as they face different kinds of supernatural threats like ghouls and vampires. Alucard is considered the most powerful vampire as well as the most powerful being in the whole series. He is the only one true immortal and cannot be truly killed. He displays vast vampiric abilities that other vampires don't have, like summoning familiars and absorbing the abilities and memories of anyone he killed. He enjoys battles and tends to prolong his fights just to belittle and insult his opponents before finally killing them. Even with his vast powers, he remains loyal to the Helsing family. Number 3. Modaichi Tachi ga Isekai Kara Karu So Desu Yu Three gifted children, Sakamaki Izayao, Kudo Asuka, and Kusakabe Yo, are blessed with tremendous psychic powers. One might think that this would make their lives more exciting, but the kids just found it too boring. On one fateful day, they receive an envelope that transports them to an unknown world known as the Little Garden. This place is full of people who, like them, possess supernatural gifts. It is further revealed that they were summoned by a member of a fallen community who calls herself Black Rabbit in order to help them defeat the tyrannical Devil King. Izayao Sakamaki is a very powerful esper because of his mysterious ability called Code Unknown. Not much is known about his ability aside from its devastating effect to nullify and destroy other people's gifts. Aside from his powerful gift, he also displays tremendous strength and speed. Number 2. Needless The story is set in the year 2130, 50 years after World War III. The city of Tokyo, Japan is no more than a huge crater that has nothing in it but contaminated rubble. The fallen city is now declared as one of the many black spots located throughout Japan. These areas are eventually populated by outcasts and vagrants. Exposed by the contamination, these outcasts and vagrants eventually develop supernatural abilities called fragments. Those who wield such fragments came to be known as the Needless. Adam Blade is the first ever successful experiment subject of the Adam Project. He is a destroyer priest and is considered one of the most powerful characters in the series. Blade displays a lot of abilities such as super strength, endurance, and vast healing powers. He also displays superhuman and vulnerability thanks to a special metal called Ori Halcom attached to his skeletal structure. His special ability is called Zero, a powerful Needless Fragment ability that allows him to memorize and copy other Needless Priest's powers. Number 1. Mahoka Koko no Redisei 
Mahoka Koko no Redise is set in the year 2095, where the world has discovered magic and utilized it as a form of technology. The series focuses on the Shiba siblings, Tatsuya and Miyuki, and their life as new students in a magic university. Tatsuya is considered one of the strongest, if not the strongest, character in the series. His abilities vary greatly from other magic users. It is even possible that he has no magical abilities at all, but instead has something even greater like a superpower. He specializes in long-range precision attacks and is strongly implied to have the greatest attack strength in the whole magical community. Aside from his complex magical abilities, Tatsuya possesses supreme combat abilities. He studied under one of the most famous ninjutsu users and is capable of defeating his opponent with physical strength alone. He is frequently shown to use his combat abilities along with his magic. He is also very knowledgeable in the field of magic engineering and is capable of understanding complex magical theories and structures.